murder me, are you? I don't think so. I need to ride that back home. Alright. We're on our way to Grand Rapids Comic Con. Now, this is kind of like the home game. All my buddies from the surrounding area, West Michigan, set up at this show, go to this show. Leon's one of my old school toy collecting buddies. He, uh, <laughs> he won't admit it though. We're bringing a, another little guest that's sleeping. What, what did you think of me the first time we met? No job. <laughs> no, no, it's, that pretty, that's pretty correct. So we'll come back to you at Grand Rapids Comic Con. We'll show you around some booths and introduce you to some people. So see you in a minute. All right, we're here. Um, we're an hour and a half early. As you can see, people are already waiting in line. We got some cosplayers. My son doesn't care about any of that. He sees the escalator. You like escalators? Yeah. Awesome. Leon, what do you got there? Oh, build a figure. Jolly Green Giant. You, you selling it here? Already sold. Already sold. Nice. All right, cool. We're going to get in there momentarily and show you some treasures. All right, we just got in. Luckily, I know someone. Um, there's hardly anybody here, and that's going to change quite uh, quickly. An hour and a half before the hordes of people come in, so we got a little sneak peek. Um, my buddy Travis, Travis is in the middle of talking, so I'm not going to interrupt. This is my buddy uh, Kyle and Jason's booth. As you can see, there's some really, really neat stuff in here. Uh, collection of modern, We've got vintage G.I. Joes down here, and I got to check those out. My son is shaking for some reason, so I just put that robe on him. Um, great. In humanoids, you don't see these carded very often. My buddy Jason Boonstra has these. Contact Jason Boonstra if you see anything that you want, and I'm sure he will mail it, ship it to you, what have you. Oh, wow. Cool transformers. Where do we find these? Jason and I live close to each other, so we're always hunting in the same stomping ground. You know, if he finds someone on Craigslist or Facebook Marketplace in the area, I'm like, no, you got it before I did. Ooh, some mask, mint on card, last action hero, Dune. He's had those for like four years. Not real hot sellers, apparently. Um, what everyone loves nowadays, these Black Series Star Wars. A lot of Kyle stuff. Marvel Legends. Neat figures, loose and carded. Here, let's go over here, okay? Just a, a hodgepodge of all sorts of things. If you love comics, comics galore. Keep looking around. Man, I love coming here when there's hardly anybody here. It's, it's quite nice. Some booths. People are away, so they put sheets there to say don't come over here. It's like some arts and crafty type stuff. A lot of artists bring their wares here. Very cool. Legos. I gotta watch Wandering Hands because he'll be like, oh, next thing I know, he'll, he'll be five boots down and he'll have some $90 Lego figure in his hands. Uh oh. Let's not worry about that. Did you do that? No. Oh, okay. But a great Comic Con. I mean, it's massive. Again, uh, Grand Rapids, Michigan, large city. Clocks. Pokemon shirts, which my wife loves that uh, Pokemon Go game. That'll be a great gift for her. She's addicted to it. Oh no. Oh no. Walking around doing my tour. That's my son. You have a son? Yes, I, I have all a you son. Had toys. No, I, I tur he used to be a toy, but he turned okay. into a, a real person. He, uh, want? Like Pinocchio. Oh, nice. yeah. Nice. Can you say hi to him? Mr. Rodriguez and say thank you. Hi. Hey, cool sweatshirt. Isn't that neat? Retro Rags Limited. Yeah. How are you doing here? Good, man. What are you uh, promoting Tulip? Yeah. Yes. Tulip City, maybe selling a little bit of comic books. So. Oh, nice. Yeah. But uh, we finally landed on a date. So uh, 
Tulip City is in the... Oh, jeez, oh, Pete. Who let this guy in? Hey, brother. How you doing, brother? Good to good, see you. Good, good. But Tulip City is yeah. a Comic-Con that you put on. Yep. Um, We're going where, in our fourth year. Fourth year. Holland, Michigan. A great con. And this is your mascot. I think yeah. we talked about him. You had a prototype yep. the last time Captain I came Tulip. here. I've got a couple little things. I got my little puppet over here. So oh! So. Look at... Um, there's a girl that is here that makes uh, puppets. Um, I think it's her... Her booth is Ruppets. Ruppets. So I had her commission a little bit of a that is Captain so Tulip. Look at, look at this. Hello. Oh my goodness. Isn't that crazy? <laughs> so yeah. So we're gonna have fun. That's Long awesome. weekend. So you here the whole week just today? No, I'm just here for a couple hours. I brought, nice. um, brought my son and my buddy Leon. So we're gonna do a stroll before the so zombies come in here in a minute. So yeah, good seeing you, brother. Okay. Always a pleasure. Yeah. Man. I'll catch up with you in a little bit. Look at these beauties. Oh my goodness. Oh, Christar. Storm Shadow. Oh my goodness. All the treasures. Good. good. How are you? Good, good. 50 bucks. Nice. Ooh, what are these over here? These are applause figures from 89. Yes. Oh my gosh. I forgot about these. What do you got on the bag? Um, well, usually, I mean, I can sell them all to you. I oh, usually what get 10 a piece out of the Mario's and then the Hippo and the Mac, they're 20. They're oh, a little rare. Oh, okay. But, but they're all pretty new. I don't think they really ever played with them. Sold about all of them. These are neat. Look at that. Oh, little Macs there, Hippos there. All right, I'm going to be back. We'll do some negotiating after right. this. You got a great booth. Really good treasures. Yeah. What do you see? Oh, yeah. Watch where you're going, buddy. The Hulk. Some trading cards. You can see a guy in a cage. What do you see? Oh, wow. What is that? I actually have no idea what this is. He can't get out, no. Some neat masks. Wow, Magneto, Boba Fett, the Rocketeer, Cosplay Crusades. <gasps> the finest are here. Holy crap. Look at. I... No, 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 don't climb up there. Don't climb up there. Yes, it's, it's a big. Look at it, it's like Daddy's toy. Remember, Daddy has this toy. It's a big one. Wow. How cool is this? Wow. We've got the Viper helmet over there. Yes. So cool. Let's check out some of the neat artwork. Oh, wow. Yeah. That is cool, huh? Yeah, how are you shivering? Oh my goodness. <laughs> Ooh, Night Raven over there, patches. Got those neat, remember from Star Wars? Yeah. Wow. They're robots. Yeah. Star Trek, hello. Yeah, what do you got? What would you see? Wow. Clock is ticking. People are about to come in here. I'm, I'm running around like mad. I had to stop at one of my good buddies, Gavin's, who parties at Collector's Corner in Grand Rapids area. So he has some amazing hello. How Hi, are buddy. you, sir? How's it going? Good. How are you? Good Doing to see right. you. Absolutely. Awesome, awesome. I just wanted to admire. Where Please. are you located? Where's Tardy's Collectors Corner? 2009 Eastern Air, Grand Rapids, Michigan. Grand Rapids. 9507. So if you see something you want, you can look them up on Facebook, and I'm sure he ships. This this is a taste. There's a lot more in the store. Oh, yeah. ton. Whoa, you got a sorcerer? What do you got on Sorceress? I don't... One time. Gosh, she has jumped. She has she gone, is I, gone I sold crazy. A, I sold a complete scare glow with the green, not the glow in the dark, yeah. 225. Oh my 
I was buying those for like 60 bucks last year. When and I they said, jumped after the toys that made us. The toys that That's made us did, did it. it. That's what it, I've been saying. It went crazy. That's exactly what I've been saying. Oh. No, man, it went bonkers. Whoa, I never uh, saw this one before. But I know what you mean about bound stuff. I had a lady who had all of the Burton wow. Claremont stuff. And a bunch of other... Make sure my son's still here. Okay, he's still wandering around with a sucker. Nice I love going okay, into well, bins like this. Hey, enough. how are you? You know. Just well, random Motu what? weapons. You know. <gasps> oh, ho, 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 ho. So, oh, dang it. Dang it, dang it, dang it. Ooh. Wow. What? What? Yeah. He's got the He-Man eraser. It's, All right, let's keep walking this way, buddy. How are you doing? Good, you? Good, good. This is Gavin's wife, Hello. also the owner of Tardis. So, yes, she is awesome because she's a wife that likes this kind of pop culture stuff. It's great. You guys are an excellent team. Yeah, for sure. What is this again? Comic grab bag. So, how does this work? The wheel. The wheel is just, um, it helps you choose whichever blocks to pick it out of. Oh. You know, it's nothing specific, just, you know, instead of picking from six boxes, you get to pick from one box. Yeah. They're all the same chances, you know. Okay, nice. And they're all, like, really good, you know, stuff. Right, right. Yeah. Awesome, That's I like it. That's a good idea. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> what have you found? What, what do you, what'd you... What did I find? You had a handful of stuff a minute it's ago. It's long gone. It's long gone already? <laughs> I got it before I, you did. Yes, he had Skeletor weapons, accessories. I'm like, mother scratcher. I knew I should have gotten here before this guy. But did you find some decent stuff already? Yes, I found uh, Warrior Beast. That's cool. Oh. The purple one or something. Yeah, yeah. There's so many different we, ones. We, we scoured the place before you got in here. So. Gosh nothing, dang there's it, there's left. no more deals. Nothing left, sorry. Oh. <laughs> And we, this, left, we left you Pirates of the Galaxy. I like this one. This yes. one actually is really neat. Pirates of the Galaxy. Cool. Um, but mainly when I collect knockoff stuff, I like the ones with animal heads. That's my kind of poor yeah, take. We found a couple of them. Oh, they're scratch. <laughs> Sorry. And what'd you, what'd you get here? Uh, well, I picked yeah. up some Star Wars that are still at the vendor booth, but there was two yak faces in it. Shh. Oh, there was not. I don't lie. Gosh. Dang it, I gotta get here and before these snag. guys. No. Okay. Oh, a blue snag. I'll post pictures, you'll see. Oh but um, I, I'm almost done with the Dick Tracy line, yep. so I was very happy to find this. This is neat. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Are you gonna keep it in the box, or how are you gonna do this? I'll probably open them up. You're gonna open it, put yeah. it on display? Yeah, I'll cut, I'll cut the front out and put it on display. And all that. You're a big Starcom guy. Are you done with your Starcom collection? I Can I help you, sir? Sir, do you need any help? I, I just wanted to make sure that my buddy Rudy was going to get credit for helping pimp out your YouTube I, viewers here. Yeah. Oh, yes. That's so, right. Absolutely. As long as he's credited. S sir, security, you have a homeless person that wandered into the venue. Um, but Starcom is my, my number one toy line. Is it complete? Uh, for the U.S. available thing. Yes. Okay. Gotcha. The European stuff, there's only so much we can do. Yeah. Spending $90 for a thing the size of my fist is oh, It's hard, isn't it? I, I deal with the same thing with E-Man and G.I. Joe. There's those obscure Argentina or UK versions, and I'm like, I want them because they're a different color, but do I want them for $300? And I've noticed that I've been hoarding it. Yeah. So why do I have 10 of these ships? It doesn't make any sense at all. I know, it doesn't. But it's same. My wife is very patient, so That's whatever. awesome. At least you have a patient or 100. Life, so cool. I'm oh. gonna keep wandering around, hopefully, find Justice. something you didn't Happy find. Happy yes. What do you got? Nice pieces. Carl Man. already got to a lot of it. I, 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 oh, if Carl already <laughs> cherry picked it, then he left, he left the scrap. Oh, I did. Yeah. Sorry. That's all right. This is it. What is this? That is a uh, Japanese headmaster's board game. I gotta show it to Ben first. No, you're, you're don't show it to Ben. Holy moly. Yeah, it's cool. All the cards are different headmasters and different transformers and stuff. And the cards have the designs from the packaging. Yeah. Oh, that's neat. I gotta show it to Ben as first. Yeah, I know. Ben's the transformer friend in our group. All right, I'm gonna run around, make sure they did. Oh, what's this? That's neat. A little bit of Robotech. All right, let's keep looking around. Modern toys, wrestlers, it looks like. 
but I did well. I flipped a big lot of wrestling figures um, recently, and they were selling like hotcakes. Just got a little bit of time. Art, beautiful, beautiful art. I love seeing this. People's interpretation of certain figures and how they get it down. I'm looking for other vintage toy types. My eyes are bouncing around. Anime, cosplay stuff. Um, custom mugs. Real neat stuff. Real, real cool things. Um, a little bit of everything, no matter what you collect. Hello, how are you? Good. Oh my goodness. Ah! Back to the Future hat. I bought that from Travis a while ago. Some plushes. More art. <gasps> Justin, look what I see. What's over there? Do you see that? Yeah, Close your eye. Go. What is it? Ghostbusters. All right, let's go check it out. Oh my goodness, he is obsessed with Ghostbusters right now. That's all he wants to watch is Ghostbuster, Ghostbuster, Ghostbuster. So I'm sure. Look at look at the sign, buddy. It's the Ghostbusters. Isn't that neat? Wow, look at it. Yeah, how are you? Good. Yeah, it's the Ghostbuster. Can we walk around it? Yeah. Cool, thanks. Wow, look at there's a ghost inside of it. Can you see? Here, I'll pick you up. Look at it. Oh, scary. Yeah. Yeah, look at it. Who's in the back? Who's in the back? It's Slime. Slimer, that's right. Wow, this is neat, man. Look at it, an ectopep. Don't touch anything. Yeah, it's very dangerous because it shoots out electricity and captures ghosts. Isn't that neat? Yeah. Wow. Yeah, yeah, well, no, we're not going to drive it. We'll just look at it. Isn't that cool? It's like driving your living room. <laughs> right? I can imagine. He's obsessed with Ghostbusters right now. That's, That's all he good. watches over and, no over and over and over again. My no. grandkids, I, I got them messed up the same way. Really? Oh, yeah. yeah. I don't have it on in the car because I got a wrangle that's done up down the street. Yep. I don't have it on. <laughs> That's awesome. They, That's... Get a little, they get a little perturbed. That is so cool, man. It's really cool. I keep trying to watch, let him watch the, the newest one. He doesn't want to watch it. He will not watch it. Yeah, I, Elliot, my grandson, he's going to be three. He, he'll watch parts of it, of course, mm -hmm. when they're fighting the ghost. But, yep. you know, like even, even the old one, he'll parts. Yeah. Animated, he'll sit and watch the whole thing. Really? I can't get him into the animated as, as well. He just The first one, the first one. Now he's getting in Ghostbusters 2 because he likes the baby part, you know. And Once he gets along, he'll start getting more of it. That's right. Well, cool. Thanks a lot. Yeah, you yeah. All right. Let's keep looking around for a little bit before the, all the crowds get in here. Wow. Photos, twenty dollar. Video, free. <laughs> and you got to be careful. Um, some booths, like I've known in uh, other shows, we can't go over there. We can't go over there. It's too dangerous. <laughs> He's like, look at that dinosaur. I want to get in there. Yeah, he's going, I'm going to get in there and start it. Just when you walk in that guy, tell me his name, and I'll, I'll the guy, when he's here, yes. I'll have the guy. Okay. Go, hey, Jacob. J or, Justin. Oh, yes. And and then he, he might pull in crap's pants. I'll do that. That sounds like a great idea. Yeah. Thanks. Bye-bye, <laughs> Justin. See ya. Say bye-bye. So make sure I know, because he has to hide. Okay. You know, he, he makes me feel scared. Yeah. Sweet. Thanks. People are so friendly, other than wanting to electrocute someone, but that's cool. Um, Rick and Morty, more movies, animes, flask, and leather work, and coasters. Great, great pieces of art. Oh, wow. But as far as vintage toys are concerned, or things that I would be most interested in, I mean, it's basically my buddies. You know, the Tardy's Corner, Travis, Kyle. Those guys are the ones that have the vintage toys. And I've already picked through their stuff, so it's not like I'm finding a lot of 
you know, stellar deals. But just hanging out with my friends and seeing them, it's fun. So I was making my way around and I ran into a very, very famous person, probably the most famous person I've ever met. He is none other than a host of Podcasters of the Universe, Jeremy DeWitt. Hello. What's up? Gosh, how can I have like a piece of your hair? And you can have whatever you want. And send it to AFA, get it graded. <laughs> you should. Yeah, get get the white hairs right here. These are vintage. <laughs> Ooh, those, those are vintage. Well, like I said, uh, Jeremy and Steven do a great podcast called Podcaster the Universe. It is a He-Man inspired mm -hmm. themed podcast. Very, yes. They they let me go on at one time. They'll never let me go on again. It totally derailed, but I had to blast. Yeah, it was it was a little bit of fun. Yeah, and we, we've we've been a little bit, not a lot of bit of fun. It was it was a little it was a lot of bit of fun for me. <laughs> I think no fun from Steve. So you put those two together and it becomes a little bit of fun. So. It's very well put. I had a blast. Well, <laughs> and and we actually get, have gotten noticed because of you. So you know. Oh, Shout out to this guy. Hey, yeah. awesome, awesome. Yeah. It's re reciprocal. Is that the word? Yeah, sure. Symbolical? I don't yeah, it's, know. Uh, I'm like a parasite. You know, <laughs> just attached to people. <laughs> have you found anything here? I have. Yes. What'd you find? I, I found some uh, classics figures. Mm -hmm. um, I got me a green mermaid because I had the blue one, the two pack one. Yes. Um, I also picked up some uh, vintage like Remco stuff. Just, I was looking for that. Dang yeah, it. there wasn't much, so really? yeah, I got them pretty, pretty cheap. That's good. Um, I got a, a, a giant uh, demigorgon for my daughter. Yeah. And then I got like a naked dude for my wife. So. Hey, whatever you're, if, if for your wife. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I like this uh, Mario fire. Oh, thanks. You know. Over there. Did you pick I'm that hot. up here? No, he I did hot. not. I just. No, you got super. Fire. But you got to run. That's unfortunate. I walk into this place and I'm cool. <laughs> so. And I got the same jacket. Do you? That's crazy. Is it a Walmart special? Yes. Yeah. It, it, it you looks... know, uh, Pete just asked me about it. Did he yeah, really? Yeah, he's like, which, that's nice. Yeah, <laughs> you gotta get one. They're comfy. Well, cool. I'll get a piece of hair of yours later. Thanks for stopping and meeting with me. I'll sign the waiver later. You know it, baby. All right. You know it. Let's see it. I found the other host from... I'll show you. <laughs> this is the other half of Podcasters you of the me? Universe. You're like tiny. <laughs> I know. Well, I'm a big block. And it's you jump weird. into me and was, hurt me. You must have had a pre-existing condition. I did not hurt you. It's from all that working out that you do. You strained yourself and then I jumped on you. <laughs> yeah, the eating. But we were just talking to Jeremy DeWitt about Podcasters of the Universe. Oh, you were? Yes, this is the yang to the ying. Stephen Bashati. how are you? Good. Good? I'm fine. So you're here helping, helping Travis? Yeah, I came and helped Travis set all this up, uh, put up all, you know, basically design the whole layout. You designed this layout? Pretty much, yeah. That's pretty impressive. I So this would look nothing like it does right now if you weren't I'm here. I pretty big input on what goes down around here. And you do have really, all kidding aside, you do have really good display quality about you. Your collection is displayed excellently. I, oh, my, my home display Your maybe. hair is perfect. I mean, people are going to research this. and Could be better. <laughs> Could be better. Always see, spoken like a true perfectionist. So, you find anything? A couple things, yeah. You better not have found anything. You still owe me money. Nothing, so, why nothing are you spending huge. money? Um. Um. What? <laughs> he can't answer that. He's like, uh, uh, uh. So, you got nice, unbroken, which you rarely find. Yeah. The Fright Zone, He Man. Yeah. Tardy's Collector's Corner right here. Really? Like this piece is always broken or this piece is always broken? Yeah. And I, my, my personal one doesn't have this piece at oh, all. Oh, so nice. That's not for me. Well, how do you not have a merman already? I do, but I don't have one with a green belt. Whoa. Uh, I don't know about that variation. What what uh, what country uh, is that made? I don't I know anything Look, about pull, it. Pull it. I just out. know it's a green belt variant and I didn't have it. No, don't pull this out. Pull, pull it out. Pull what out? Pull this? Yeah. Oh, I can't get that out very far. Let's see. If we had Brock Schneider here, he would look at it and be like, oh, that's the, you know, 500 yeah, reproduced. Yeah, I'm not sure and... what's going on with it. I mean, I know it existed. Yeah, Taiwan, 1981. Interesting. And I don't know how plentiful they are, but I don't think I've seen one. Do you, do you know this guy in the background? I don't. I've never hey, seen him you're before. You're Justice Curry, right? Yes, I am Justice I recognize Curry. you from uh, uh, Stephen's podcast. You recognize me from, yeah, from my Steven's, voice? Yeah, from Stephen's podcast. The podcasters yes. of the universe. Yeah. Or my wife is going to kill me. Kill me both of them. You yeah. have two podcasts? I do. Well, well, this is insane. That's, that's the only way I recognize yes. you. That's no, the only way. Yeah. <laughs> All my friends are smart asses. They tease me constantly. This is Eric Brank. Hi. Original G.I. Joe collector friend. 
in the background, Pete's thinking of something witty to say to insult me. I'm sure he's got like five things in the back of his mind. It's all locked and loaded. So great booth, great setup. This is Travis. What, what do you got going on here other than me distracting you before um, setup time? Just getting ready. Okay, just, just getting ready. ready. Yep. In other words, he's like, leave me alone and stop talking to me. <laughs> um, a great, great setup here. Let me look around now one last pan behind Chris Middlecamp. Uh, I did an uh, episode before showing off some of his work. He does these customs. Yes, buddy. What's wrong? You want to go to Alec? I don't know what you're talking about. Here, let me open this sucker for you. It's like a timeout. Here, here. What's this in your mouth? Stop. I want alligator. What is he talking about? Chris Metal Camp does these wonderful, wonderful customs. Very talented. Many of uh, our pieces from Mythic Legions to He-Man to G.I. Joe, Chris Metal Camp's um, done them. Ooh. I love this. I love the glow in the dark. But Travis has some great things. I'm gonna do a Kane County here video shortly and I, I helped Travis set that up. So many of the things you've probably already seen back here through this little, uh, I'm guessing this is their podcast. Yep, my wife is gonna kill me. Pete, Steven and Travis do an excellent toy related podcast. You gotta check it out. Um, podcast is like a radio show that's themed that you can download it or listen to it it's free it's great just google it they have candy for me to fill my pockets um, another Chris Middlecamp special here took an old dollhouse and gored it out to make it into a haunted mansion for a hundred and fifteen dollars this could be yours but again where else could you do that do you have those skills I don't have those skills you got it. You got to pay for someone's work. That took them hours and hours. What do you got going on? There's more candy. Yeah. Well, we'll come back here later and get it. Okay. All right.